people. Got this stuff up on my screen. And I don't know how to get rid of it, so I can't see anybody that comes in. Wish I could, but it won't, it won't go off. Anyway, I don't really have much to say today. I'm out here in my Pekingese paradise. Hi, Russian. How you doing? Hi, here for, here for you, nine ninety nine. I don't know if any of you guys know. You probably don't know what's going on over in my group, but they're a bunch of idiots. They've been having a marathon talks, all group of women, all of them talking about meth, all of them staying up 24 hours a day, running that mouth, repeating themselves, wanting you to pick sides. They're all idiots. I hope... I caught some of my people in there listening. Hi, Colby. But I hope they were just watching for entertainment because that's all it was. Because let me straighten one thing out for you right now, ladies. There is no S.A. to read. The community witch keeps going on and on and on and on about an S.A. report. There isn't one. I read the whole boring court case. There's nothing about an S.A. in there. The S.A. is in her head. So she needs to shut up about it. And on the other hand, Squirrel Girl needs to shut up about her taking those stupid ass videos down. Because if any of these women had a brain, which they obviously don't, you can strike them. I struck two of her videos of me and got them down. Quit begging her and making these deals. Delete them, delete them, delete them. It's all nonsense. It's stupid. It's bullshit. And if you watch it, if any of my people are in there watching it that I don't have blocked, you better be watching it for entertainment and comedy because that's all it is. It's a joke. It's a joke. I can read. I read the documents. There's no essay in there. She never filed one. Nobody would know anything about it if she'd kept her damn mouth shut, just like half the shit that goes on on this stupid internet is somebody running their own fucking mouths about their own shit. If you don't want people to know stuff, shut the fuck up. And you don't spend two or three or four or five days threatening everybody to take videos down when all you have to do is strike them. Are you too stupid to do strikes? If you don't know how to do it, Hyena will do them for you for 60 bucks a strike. You get rid of people on your own. That shit was stupid. It was asinine. I barely could listen to any of it. But I did hear the squirrel girl on and on and on and on and on and on. And then the community witch going on and on and talking about non-existence shit. Non-existent. It doesn't even matter. And then, don't get me started on that gangster. I cannot understand a word that girl said. She sounds... From looking at her old videos a long time ago, something has gone totally wrong with her voice. And you get that other thing beside her, that partner or whatever the fuck she is, her talking over her. They need to watch those lives and see how idiotic they sound. None of them have a vocabulary. None of them can string three or four words together that's got over two syllables. It's hideous. And I saw some of my people in there watching it, and I thought to myself... I know my women that I don't have blocked are not in there watching that shit and taking it seriously. But I'm afraid some of you are, and I feel sorry for you. Get a life, ladies, because all that is is entertainment and bad entertainment at that. There is no essay. There's none. Period. I read the documents. It was the most boring boring murder trial transcript I've ever read in my life, and I love fucking crime. That thing is boring. There's no essay. None. It is non-existent. So quit fucking talking about it. And quit telling people they got a 24 hours or you're just going to keep talking if you don't take that video down. Strike them. Have you ever heard of striking somebody and then block them? Problem solved. If I don't have you blocked, then I don't have a problem with you. If I got you fucking blocked, then I got a goddamn problem. You got that? You don't have to put up and beg and talk for 24 fucking hours and do this and just strike them and then shut the fuck up about them and get them out of your goddamn life. It's stupid. I didn't think I was going to get this mad again, but I did. Can't help it. How do you like my hair curling? Try to calm down.
party around old Pekingese Paradise today because my plants have burned up. My little yard guy came and he cut all my heads off my flowers. Wish I can be that blunt. Well, you need to be blunt, Colby. It's a joke. There is no S.A. There's no sense of picking sides because you're picking sides with idiots. They're, both sides are total idiots. So who are you fighting for? What are you sticking up for? Because they're too goddamn stupid to strike a channel on their own. They can do a copyright strike or a privacy strike, either one. Get them down yourself instead of sitting there. And then the other witch is sitting there crying and boo-hooing and all that shit. Who gives a fuck? Move on. Get a goddamn life. And gangster, if you got a point to make, you better go get something done about your goddamn voice because it's hideous. And that sidekick of yours needs to shut off because they overtalk each other. You can't. Just know how to read. Which you obviously, none of you could read or you'd know there was no S.A. at all in any of them papers. I read them all and I can't stand fucking fake. But she even had that part right because she read them too and there's no S.A. in there. None at all. So nobody has exposed that lunatic's S.A. to anybody because there isn't one. It doesn't exist. Understand me? It doesn't exist. And if you want the videos down, strike them and shut the fuck up about it. Now, I'm going to calm down, I think. You want to see Hyena? She's out of here. She don't like hearing me bitch and rant raves. I'm good people. I'm smart. I don't know how good I am, but I'm fucking smart, and I don't lie about nothing, and I don't fall for all this fucking bullshit that's been going on for two goddamn years straight with no end in sight. There's real shit going on, people. Real shit. I don't have a thing about none of this shit on my YouTube channel. Not one thing, unless I upload these lives, which I might do because they were stealing my fucking lives. I gotta see who wants to come up here. Somebody does. Let's see who it is. You wanna come up here? I don't know why that dot's on that camera. There was two people down there and I didn't know the other one. I'm just sick of it. I wasn't even going to mention it. I was just going to talk how wonderful it was to meet Betsy. I wish she'd have had time to come and spend a couple days with me and meet Hyena. She really wanted to meet her. I don't know why she's being so standoffish. She's way out there. She won't, she won't come to me. So anyway, there's no essay, none whatsoever. If she would shut her mouth about it, nobody would know. There's no sense of having threatening somebody to take their damn stupid ass videos down because you can strike them. If it's strikeable, you can strike them. I will light a fucking channel up in a heartbeat. Easy to do. None of this 24-hour methathons, and I don't think any of them know what they're talking about. They didn't ask me nothing, and I'm the expert. Come here. Come here, Bubby. You hot? Hot out here, isn't it? Yes, it is. Very hot out here. This is Picasso. He doesn't do spells or anything. He doesn't even really know anything, but he's cute. He's cute, cute, cute for a Pekingese. Yes, he is. It's hot out here, too. Now I'm all mad, and I'm powdering a meth head in church. Anyway, I wish I could have watched more of that so I could have told you more about it. But what I saw of it was so stupid and disgusting. And why in the world they spent that many days on nothing? Absolutely nothing. No essay, period. The murder trial was the most boring piece of shit in papers I ever read in my life. It was hideous. It wasn't exciting. There was no mystery. It was all out there. Why all this is making such a turmoil, ladies? I have no idea. I don't know who, why you're picking sides because whichever side you pick, you need to be just like me and just watch it for fun. Laugh about it. Laugh about them. Because that's all it is. It's a joke. I wonder if any of them women ever watch any of those panels that they get on because if they did they would be embarrassed if they weren't embarrassed there's something very wrong with them if they can't sit and let each other talk they have to all scream and yell and talk over each other and talk with people in the damn comments and do this and do that it's sickening it's stupid and i know when i was on a debate team something they don't know nothing about we had 
12 people up there on a debate team and knew enough to keep her mouth shut while the other person made a point, but maybe that is a point. None of them have a point. They're jokes. They're all jokes. And I guess they're doing it for views. I don't know. I don't know how long people can stay and listen to that same repetitive, ignorant, talking about an essay that doesn't even fucking exist and never did, threatening people to take their channels down and you're going to keep talking. Well, keep talking. Who cares? If you're too dumb to do a strike, then oh well, I guess you can talk somebody to death or threaten them. I bet if they would have played those stupid marathons at Waco when they were trying to get David Koresh to come out, he would have come out and said, hey, I give up. I can't listen to no more of this bullshit. In fact, the FBI needs to take these two bunch of women and just let that shit play the next time they have a hostage situation. Believe me, they'll be coming out with their arms up. They cannot stand to listen to that shit and how ignorant it is. It's so ignorant, so stupid. I'm so glad I'm out of it. And I hope that none of my people that I that watch that stuff and are actually taking sides have more brains than that. I thought they did because there's no sides to take. Whichever side you take, it's losers. They're all losers. They're all bottom feeders. They don't have any content, so they just have to bite and bitch at each other and pray that somebody will listen to it and be interested in it. And they do the same thing on the case. And all this cop calling business, let me give you a little update, ladies. You all do it. I don't. I've never called a cop in my life. I've never called CPS in my life. I don't think that shit's funny at all. But I grew up in a lifetime where you didn't do that shit, where you had character. They're calling cops everywhere. They're calling cops over on KJ side. They're calling cops on this side. For what? The cop. And let me tell you something. They're making a new law, and Hyena can verify this. From now on, you women that got nothing better to do than make phony phone calls, you're going to be the ones going to jail because they've had enough of it. This internet shit has made these nuisance calls skyrocket, and they're going to put a stop to it. And I hope they do, and I hope they do it soon, because anybody that thinks that shit's funny has something seriously wrong with them. Seriously wrong with them. I've been beat almost to death and never called the fucking cops. I never called a cop in my life. I would never do it. I don't call CPS, or you can't call jobs, because hardly any of these lunatic-ass, worthless women have a job. But if they did, I wouldn't be calling their jobs. So wake up, grow up, and do something besides listen to that bullshit and take sides and, oh, I'm mad because I saw so. Who cares? I don't want to be seen in any of them damn groups. I'd be embarrassed to be in there, any of them. They're all idiots. I watch real people. They have real shit going on professionalized people. Oh, but I do have some good news. I found all my porn stuff, every bit of it, all my videos, all my pictures, because I had my high-speed internet connected. I got into my desktop. I got into the file that Mike, my wonderful webmaster guy that passed, and it said, Shaker Ladies Porn File. And this wonderful man had put all my files, all my porn pictures, all my videos, all my clients in one beautiful file that I found. And I went through it. And man, I'll tell you what, ladies, if you do live to be 70, it's not easy looking at how far you fall down. Because it's sad when I look now, what I used to look like and what I see now. It's very sad. But it probably won't happen to many. I don't see many of them in very good health last till 70 let alone have their mind because most of them don't have a mind now so i'm just gonna get off of here hyena come here i'm gonna see if hyena wants to make a little appearance she's coming i'm gonna give everybody a blessing even though i could care less anybody gets blessed come here sweetheart come here come here where i can reach you hyena no i'm not picking you up okay i don't know if she's gonna want to do this or not you want to do a blessing? You don't feel like it? Oh, baby. You don't want to do a blessing because you don't think they deserve it. I don't either, honey. Maybe they'll all be going to jail if they keep that stupid cop calling up. What do you think about that? I don't care if they use fake numbers or not, but you don't think them cops got a way to check towers? Come here. Hey, hyena. There we go. You're getting about a half ass blessing. About all she feels like. It's too hot. We got to go in the house. Ah, 
I don't even want to show you my pathetic flowers because tell you what, my little flower man went crazy and chopped the heads off a bunch of them. But he knows what he's doing. He's getting paid for it. So bye, ladies. Ciao. Try to realize that this shit is a joke. That there's no essay. Hi, Lee Carson. There's no sense of being on sides because guess what? Hey, stepmama. We got some idiots over here, stepmama. You just think your bunch of people's crazy. You ought to come over here and listen to a meth head, so they say, 24-hour marathon. I don't think any of them, they can talk, but they repeat themselves. A real meth head can talk sentences and whole things. Hmm. Anyway... Hey, stepmama. Love you, gal. I'm so glad I've got you group of people that I can go hang with instead of trying to be over here with this stupid bunch. I've got so many of them blocked now. I think <clears throat> most of the people I talk to are your side because this bunch is never going to change. Two years is long enough to let everybody know this is a joke. It's going to stay a joke. And by the way, I'm apprehensive sky. I'm everything that everybody accuses me of. Everything. I'm apprehensive sky. I run 60 or 70 Reddit pages. The only thing I'm not is a fucking cop caller or a CPS caller. And I can read. And I read the goddamn documents. And there was no essay in there. And don't threaten people to take their videos down. Why don't you just strike them? Hyena will do it for you for 60 bucks instead of giving the old gal 200. Hyena will do it for 60. Pick out who you want struck. It's got to be something legit. Can't just be something you've made up in your mind. I guarantee you, she knows how to strike a channel. She struck a few of them. They ain't using my shit no more and getting by with it. They have to come up with their own meth head shit. They're not using mine. And watch how ladylike I can drink. Mmm. She said it's a seal. It ain't sealed. It was on Reddit two fucking months ago. It's not sealed. It's a goddamn court case. And there's no essay in it because she never filed an essay. I ain't saying this shit didn't happen to her. Who cares? Who knows? I don't. But I know one thing. Whining and belly aching and threatening suicide for two months over a goddamn document that's not even there is psychotic. It is very psychotic, or else she's wanting attention so bad that she's desperately making up some kind of a hideous ass lie. There was no essay to be sealed. The essay is in her fucking head. She don't know where an essay is. If she did, don't you think she'd have it out there to prove to everybody that one exists? Because the documents that everybody's been reading ain't done a goddamn thing to her. Just said she was a witness that they didn't even need or use because her fucking testimony was hearsay. Get the documents out and read them. You don't need fucking Emily Baker to read shit. I can read shit to you. You want to give me a big old huge... 200,000 subscriber channel, I'll read all your goddamn documents and explain them to you. I got enough brains to do that, and I can also strike channels, so if you need a channel, channel striking person, here I am. And I also know all about math. Got any questions about math? I'm in for it. I'm here. So, I'm getting off of here. I was hoping I wouldn't have to be mad. How would anybody know what happened to that stupid ass psychotic if she wouldn't have been running her mouth? I'm waiting. Waiting. Nobody knew. Nobody cared. Nobody cares if the damn videos are up or if they're down. If you want her videos down, strike them, people. I will have Hyena do it to you for 60 bucks. I'm not even going to talk. I don't even know what that gangster and her sidekick are talking about because I can't understand either one of them. They talk over each other. They garble words. I have no idea. If you want to be on their team, go ahead. Figure out what they're talking about. I'm not on a team. I'm by myself. Always have been. And now that I got all my porn stuff, I'm thinking about putting... I don't know how I could put it up. That place, that Pell Talk is still there and just run old reruns, call it rerun porn or something like that. I found them all. I'm so glad I found them. I didn't know where they were. I didn't know who could have had them all, but I've got them all. I've even got some of my clients still that I talk to. It's like happy reunion day for me yesterday. I was so happy when I found all that stuff. So happy. 
almost as happy as I am here with my Pekingese. Anyway, Betsy, last week was much better because I had a little sweet soul with me. I don't have anybody with me today but me. I'm going to let you guys go. I will see you next Tuesday. I may do actual, I may do a real, thinking about doing a stream yard this weekend and going and talking to some of my outlaws, some of my meth people, some of my ex-husbands, do some interviews because I'm good at interviewing people. She's crazy. I know. Why, why are you worried about it? I love Betsy, too. I lo They're all crazy. You pick one. Throw a nickel down in the group, and whoever it hits is crazy. Because they're all crazy, and the people that go in there and listen to them, I'm beginning to wonder about them. I mean, I can see going in there. And, well, I don't go in there, but I listen to it. But I'm not going to get up in the conversation and say, well, I'm on so-and-so's side, and I'm on. Because I don't give a fuck about none of them. I'll tell you right now. If I've got you blocked, I don't give a fuck about you. And if you're not blocked, I like you. And I've had some kind of conversation with you. I'm not going to do all this stupid-ass bullshit. I'm too old. I've already been through it all. You run a porn room, ain't nothing after that bothers you. So everybody pick sides, do sides, draw straws, do whatever you do. I'm telling you right now, these cop calling motherfuckers are getting ready to pay because they just about had enough. From now on, there better be something really wrong or the person making the calls is going to be going down. And I can't wait because it's stupid. It's ridiculous. And there's no excuse for it. No excuse for doing shit like that. And they all do it. It's not just one side or the other. I've been around this group long enough to know and heard enough stories that they've all done it at one time or another. And they think it's funny. And I really don't know what's funny about it. Hey, meth head, I got one of my buddies in here. From one meth head to another. I'll tell you one thing, though. That goddamn shit them women are on talking four or five days straight, 24-hour marathons. I wouldn't mind finding out who they get that shit from because mine ain't that good. I can't talk that long, that straight on nothing. I have to have my Pekingese or something to talk about. And it's getting ready to rain, and I'm going to go in the house. And I'm going to upload this to my YouTube channel. And I've got some neat stuff on there. I've got some boxing on there. I've got some horse stuff on there. I've got my dog stuff on there. But I don't have anybody else's content all mine so the oldest and baddest is signing off ciao love you